Hey everybody, what we have here is a floor mat made by Best Step. Uh, it's called Inter Interlocking Comfort Flooring. Um, it has nine interlocking tiles with 12 borders. And this is how much area it covers. This product I think is fantastic. Uh, my brother uses it in his basement. Um, he has it right by his workbench. And as you know, this basement is eventually going to get a workbench as well. And this is like a very great thing to stand on if you're like getting tired of standing on the, you know, the basement floor or something. Um, so um, you can use it in other places like you, you can use it in a laundry room. You can use it uh, by your front door or in a mudroom. Or you can use it if you're going to like, you know, draw pictures or something and not make a whole mess on the floor. Uh, if you look right there, it says accessories not included, which is pretty funny. Of course, made in China, but it's not a piece of machinery and it's not a moving part. So I guess, you know, time will tell how it is. But his, he's had now for, I don't know, maybe roughly a year or so, and it's been fine. So I'm going to hope that it, um, it works here as well. Uh, you can, um, they got theirs at Costco. They also got this one for me, too, from the same store as well. I don't know if you can get anywhere else. Maybe you can, but um, Costco is where they found it. So if you have one of those stores by you, you can probably get this from there. Uh, let's see. Um... This microband thing, I don't quite know. I guess it has something like that. I'm not too sure, but you know, easy to clean, water resistant, which is always good. Cut to fit. And uh, let's see if there's anything on the back. Uh, let's see. Um, okay, I guess it has like different dimensions and uh, everything. And uh, oh, look at this. Uh, Distributed by Costco Wholesale, so maybe you can only get it there. I'm not sure, but, I mean, there's a good chance you will find it there. Look at this, UK, Japan, Spain, all over the place. So, it uh, must be a pretty good product, I guess, or it could just be the Costco's all over. And there's currently nine tiles inside this wrapping, and you can see it all fits together. Kind of, let me go on the other side, it might be easier to see. <clears throat> kind of like a, a jigsaw puzzle of sorts, like, you know, you have um, ends here. And you just interlock them together. And you obviously you know the main difference between this and a puzzle is everything fits all together no matter what. <laughs> but you can kind of see the similarities there. Okay, so let me go ahead and take off the wrapping and show you how to put it together. And here's one of the tiles um, by itself. Uh, you can tell this is one of the corners because it has um, the straight borders on, uh, on two sides instead of just one. And I mean, really, the way, uh, same thing with this one, as you can see, um, there's... Uh, there's the yeah, two borders and then the two open ends right there. And what you can do though is, is uh, well actually I'll show that to you in a bit, but um, let's see, well this, yeah. Interestingly enough, the interlocking pieces, one of them is like this. I guess maybe this is to help ensure that you fit them you know, together correctly so they line up well, I'm not sure, but it's uh, kind of interesting how they do that. So you just uh, you know, lay them across and then See, am I doing this right? Yeah. Then you just push each uh, section in. Didn't really get a good shot of that for you. So, uh, you know what? I'm noticing this end here is, um, oh, you know why? I think we just pushed in a little bit. That's why. Yeah, okay, no, that's fine. But yeah, you see how they fit together like that. So, uh, you can see how it all fits together nicely. Let me do one more because I think I, um, think I might have, uh, fit the pieces together off camera. Let me try that again. Okay. So, let's see. Yep, looks like it lines up. Then, um, wait, the border goes this way because that's where the end is. All right. And then, yeah, let's, uh, you know, put it together again. See, you just push them all together. I, l I really do like the ease of installation on this. It's really nice. And like I said, this is really great for, um, like I said, if you have a workbench, you're going to be standing on this uh, for a long time. And then, uh, you know, it's, it's more comfortable to stand on this than it is on a concrete floor. So, uh, or even a tile floor, any kind of hard floor, really. So it's a really good product for you to have. And plus, if you happen to drop any tools, it'll, chances are it'll land on the mat and not on the floor. So it's probably a good thing for the tool and possibly the floor as well. So let me go ahead and get the rest of these pieces all together, and I'll show you what the uh, finished product looks like. And here it is just about all fully together. I'll just push in this last section. And you can watch that. There we go. Just inside there. All right. Finish over here. 
and get in the rest of this side over here. Okay, and here's the uh, finished floor. Now, interestingly, they gave you nine tiles, but as you can see, I only had to use eight. So I'll just put that, you know, other tile on the shelf for now. I'm not going to throw it out, obviously, but yeah, that's a, it's a decent area to cover. And it just about covers the distance that these outlets are apart, so it is a pretty good size. Um, you, some of the dirty spots you see was just for me, from it being on the, uh, on the slab from before. And uh, yeah, so um, like I said, it's really great flooring to stand on. There's my foot right there. And, um, you know, like I said, when you're standing at a workbench or whatever, it gives you some good cushioning. And I may also in the future possibly use that this flooring for the, for the air handler over there. Maybe it might come into play uh, at some point. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, what's also nice, too, is these borders are actually detachable. So, let's say you buy other other or more of these floor mats and you want to make this area even larger you can you simply just attach the uh the border right here see that and then you can interlock more um future mats with it and if you want to go crazy you, you can buy well maybe i don't know if they have any any other colors but if they have different colored mats you can also put uh different colored ones and make a pattern if you want to you know have some fun with it if they allow such a thing uh, the only thing is this flooring is not meant for heavy weight, so it's not designed, it says right there on the thing there, it's not designed to have vehicles driven over it, so it's only designed for like, you know, people standing on it and things like that, so, but like I said, it's like, you know, when you kneel down, things like that, you have good cushioning on your knees, so the floor uh, won't hurt you over time, so like I said, like, you know, if the air handler or the furnace ever has to, ever needs to be serviced, um, if, if I put one over there, it'd be perfect for it, and... Yeah, I first saw this, I asked my brother, hey, where'd you guys get this? This looks really nice. And then uh, he actually got one for me. <laughs> Very nice of him. <sighs> and um, aside from that, that, that's about it, guys. Um, like I said, it, it's a basic uh, cushioned floor mat uh, made by Best Step. It looks like you, you can only get it at Costco. I'm not totally sure, but that's what it looks like. Maybe you can find it on Amazon. I don't know. But um, just do Costco before anything else, okay? <laughs> so it's a fantastic product. Nice and cushiony and... Really, even though this basement has windows, there's really uh, never an instance where the sun's going to be directly hitting this, or it's, it's not going to be outside and everything. So the, the condition of this floor mat should stay in good shape for, you know, a nice long time, all things considered. And like I said, I'll just put that extra floor mat on the shelf for now, because I don't really need it at the moment. But yeah, guys, uh, fantastic product. If you, if you use workbenches, or you've got to stand on hard floors when you're doing something, or you've got to kneel down, get this. It, it's, a, it's a fantastic product, good cushion. Um, when you're kneeling or whatever, and just great to have, all right? So there you have it, the best step floor mat, and it is a great product. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching, and take care.